Hey, welcome back to Chestnut Gaming. This is Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle, and this is one of the games that I have chosen to play. saying for Vegeta there. Um, his banner was really good back then, ended up rolling him, and ended up doing pretty good with him. So, have a decent account. Just kind of showing off some of my teams that I have right now. Pretty happy with what I've got. Save this new banner, but we'll talk about that here in a minute. Uh, running Shadow Dragons here. That's one of my favorite teams to run right now. I haven't awakened my Super Saiyan 4 or Gogeta just yet. Ended up getting really lucky on their two banners. Ended up pulling both of them. Just ground out stones. Bought a few stones, admittedly. So I have a, uh, I have a good 150% team that I'm running through. And it just crushes everything. It crushed the boss, the boss rush. The biggest boss rush, I think I used one item during the biggest boss rush, and I don't really even think I had to use it. I think I just used it just to be safe. So, pretty powerful team right now. I like I like the way the team's set up. So, otherwise... Got a decent um, Super AGL. That... Goku right here is going to be replaced, this one. He's going to be replaced until he gets that big awakening that he just got over in Japan. So probably going to be with the blue Veg uh, Vegeta. So I think that's what I'm looking at. This Gohan is a decent support. Is it the attack defense plus 25 and then key plus 2? It's pretty decent. So the, the team doesn't have many key problems. It's a decent team. It's gotten me through all the strength events real easy. We're going to ignore this team because the new Vegeta, uh, the new Vegeta, or Gogeta, rather, is not in my grasp. So there is my tech team, my super tech team. Now, I got lucky. I did one pull for that Super Saiyan 3 Angel Goku. And I got him and Mask Saiyan in that one pool. So my karma has probably come back to bite me on these recent banners because of that. But I'm pretty happy with it. I've got all the setup I want for a really good tech team here. There's characters, of course, I need to awaken, but I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, there's my workings on of a fusion team, but I'm not quite there. My super strength, I really, really like this team. Uh, that uh, that PyCon actually gets switched out for another Trunks um, that's a good support character. So I ended up using him in uh, like my super strength a whole lot. It's gotten through a lot of events. It almost got me through the hard the next to hardest Dokkan event. And then that was that was the world tournament team for farming the world tournament event. Now. I'm just gonna show off my boss. I think my box. I think a little bit. Hey, Roman. I think I'm just gonna show off my box a little bit. I've been pretty lucky. Let's just do this. Let's get rid of all those. I've not been so lucky on the LRs, but I only have the LR Goku just because I ground him out during that event. But otherwise, I've been pretty lucky. Got a lot of the really good tech units. Finally pulled that Tech Bardock the other day that goes along really well with the LR Goku. So LR Goku finally made it onto my team for uh, for Tech. Kind of hurting a little bit because I did not get the Super Gogeta from the recent event. In Intelligence, Strength, I'm pretty strong. Did end up pulling... Where is he... Ended up pulling this guy from his banner. Ended up pulling him actually off the ticket. My 
pulls otherwise were just terrible. So, I suppose karma coming back to haunt me. And then, my physical team, which I didn't have up, I do have all of the workings of the team. I do have the, uh, the Coolra, cooler, I do have the cooler, uh, for the team lead. And I do have the full power freeze that go along with him, the Omega Shinron. I have a fully unlocked Goku Black, but I don't have him all the way orbed. The, prior, the orb priority for me is now going over to Mr. Omega Shinron, who I got another dupe of. So, I'm definitely going to be throwing that in there. So, pretty happy with my account. I, I've dropped some cash on this, I'm not going to lie. Dropped some cash on this game. Probably will be dropping more cash in the future. May may do some extra summons here on these banners over here. Look, I'm not exactly happy with how I pulled on them and how awful they were. So, and the fact that they changed them so much, because I would have dropped a lot of cash on both of these banners if they would have stayed the way they were in Japan, because they were just great in Japan. But they chose to go a different way for the global version. So the, the Gogeta banner is just not very appealing to me because of what they changed to it. Save Omega, the Rage Trunks, and the Intelligence Gogeta there. Um, I have a fully path-opened Golden Frieza. My Buhan is near fully opened if he's not all the way opened. Uh, this is just a better banner for me right now. So I thought... What I would do, just ending this introduction video to Dokkan Battle, I thought what I'd do is I would do a pull. Since my luck has been so terrible on this banner, hopefully I've got some good luck going. We'll just do a single pull real quick to end the video. I'm sure we're about to get the rare of rares. But let's see. Maybe I'll get lucky. Got one pot. Not gonna get my hopes up for this. Because these banners have not treated me kindly. Eh, we're at least getting an SR, I suppose. More Baba food. So, Genron? Eh. I don't really need him anymore because I already have my Omega at SA10. But. Could be worse, it was a better unit, I suppose. So, anyways, that's a Dokkan Battle introduction video. I'll be adding some more content as I go along, so thanks for watching. Feel free to like it if you like the video, and subscribe if you want to see more Dokkan Battle content, and to let me know some tips if you've got any. Thanks for watching. See ya.